Good morning, everyone. Day one, Jamaica Bay. Technically, yesterday was day one. However, I got in so late that I was trying to hurry up, unload the truck, set up camp, that I didn't really get a chance to film. But uh, I've been waiting a while for this day. It's a beautiful morning. I don't know what the temperature is because I haven't checked, but you get a slight breeze. It feels great. There are quite a few kayakers out in the water already, so I'm kind of late, but better late than never, right? Check our, our lure, make sure we ain't got no salad all over it. Oh no, that is a fish. It's a tiny little blue. First fish of Jamaica Bay, baby. It's a little blue. I thought that was the bottom that I hit. Chill out, little brother. Chill out. Smokes. All right, that's what we got a net for, right? This guy's going crazy. Guess I would too if uh, I had a big old hook stuck in my mouth. There we are. There we are. First blue of Jamaica Bay, little guy. Oh gosh, yes. If I don't get hooked up right here, then I don't know what to say because there, there we are. That's what I love about saltwater fishing. All you gotta do is find them and then they're pretty much yours. It's gotta be a blue. Yep, nice little blue. Come here, baby. Oh gosh, I gotta watch my hand because those trebles will do a number on you. Okay, we got him gripped. Now, to get him off. Gosh, this guy is vicious. Look at that, fellas. They're getting a little bit bigger. Not too bad, eh? Right, let's check the line, see if that's all good. Yeah, he was foul hooked. Took a swipe at it and uh, managed to hook himself right close to the eye. Oh, there we go. Yep, that's a school of them. Come here, boy. It's probably another little one though. I mean, he's got a couple of head shakes, but that's it. Yeah little guy still fun to catch though there we are all right bro oh gosh that's what I'm there we go thank you that's what I'm worried about him flinging that darn Rapala towards me and then that's it call it quits cuz I'll need help getting the hook out of me there we go tiny little schooling bluefish hey buddy just trying it okay that's it i'm gonna put him back he's clearly camera shy schooling fish schooling fish i don't know why i always have a habit of saying everything double this may be in case y'all didn't hear it the first time okay we got that waypoint saved let's keep at it check our our line make sure there are no no abrasions or anything like that from their teeth nicks anything it's got to be nice and smooth now there's a nick right there yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna retie I don't want that to snap and then we lose this lure which I didn't 
bring another one of. All I've got is just the one. Not gonna take any chances before the tournament starts. Right there. Doing a simple uni knot. I found that with the bigger line that you're using, whether it be mono or fluoro, a uni knot is the way to go, at least for me, in my experience. Do five little loops with this big line. It's a 20 pound test. Three, four, five, and it's already wet, so just cinch it down now. There we are, guys. And now there's no doubt about it. There's no abrasions, nicks, or anything like that in my line. Now I have comfort uh, fishing it, and when under tension, it's not gonna snap unless they snap it themselves. But it wasn't due to my laziness and not willing to retie. You gotta retie. <laughs> the ones that I absolutely love uh, catching are the ones that you see on the Lowrance because you pass them over and then shortly thereafter, maybe a split second, couple seconds, they'll hit your lure because the lure comes into view. There we go, got him. Gosh, I love the sound of that drag being pulled, baby. Come here, boy. It's another schooling blue. Oh my God, how does he have that much power? Holy cow. <laughs> I, I do, that's what I love about these fish. And this is a little guy too. <laughs> oh man, he got me. <laughs> Same exact thing happened with this guy. Swiped at it, came out of his mouth, and now he's hooked on the side of the cheek. Here we are, fellas. Oh my gosh, I don't know how they have that power. That's a little guy too. Man, imagine what a 30-incher would do. That's all I can remember. Last year, the, the fight that I had with that, I think it was like 29 inches. I don't know, I'd have to look back on my videos, but that guy had some serious fight. And this little fella, 18 inches, if that, just pulling the drag, that was awesome. Okay guys, let's do this for the third time. What I was telling y'all earlier, uh, and I didn't realize that the mic was off, I, uh, I had to come back in to take a photo of a poster board that's over by the weigh-in tent. Uh, as soon as the tournament starts, you have to make sure that you take a photo of that poster board and then all the fish after that can count towards uh, your, your bag. Uh, what I also had to do was replace a sprocket and a mast. Uh, coming back in, I sheared mine clear off and thank goodness Captain uh, Jerry had a sprocket for me so I purchased that from him. He put it on, threw a mast back on, put the fin on. Now, we're getting ready to go out there for a couple of hours before coming back in for the day. So, game plan right now is just to get on the board, that's it. I'd be happy with, with anything that I get. Uh, I'm getting a late start because of the, uh, the Mirage Drive, but better late than never. All right, Dave. Hey, how's it going? You too. Thank you. Start out the way we did this morning, just trolling the Rapala Magnum. Holy cow, you don't realize how hot it is out here while you're on the water because you've got that breeze, but man, oh man, do you sweat a ton. I got a cramp whenever I was trying to get out of the kayak. Refueled with some Gatorade. Feeling a little bit better. Took a break. Oh wow, we're marking fish already. But took a break, pound the 
Gatorade, ate some lunch. Man, I feel rejuvenated. Let's just hope that the uh, fish cooperate. Yes, 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 sir. Yes, sir. I got some fish that I'm marking right now. Yes, we got them, baby. We got them. Let's take it easy. Let's try to get on the board. Holy cow. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that guy got me all wet. I thought he was actually gonna launch himself into me. It's a small little rat, but I'll take him. Little bitty guy. It's better than nothing. Oh, foot came out. The reason why I built this was to make this job easy. So let's see if it's going to be a lot easier this time to, to measure the fish. Let's get it wet. 21 incher. All right. Let's get the camera out now. That's the crap thing about using the iPhone. It's kind of hard to turn it on. Ah, i to take a selfie. Hold on, bro, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're all done, we're all done, we all done. A little 21 incher, it's a good start. Oh, right at the boat. See what it is. It's another blue. About the same size. Boy, these guys ain't bashful about getting you wet. <laughs> man, oh man. I wish there was a big guy because fighting him just, it just doesn't seem right. <laughs> <laughs> this guy is wearing me out. And he's a little guy. All right, Carlos, come on. Settle down, bro. <laughs> How much energy can this thing have? Seriously. Oh my gosh. All right, come on. Come back. Oh gosh. Oh my God. <laughs> I cannot believe this. This is a little guy too. Oh my gosh. Freaking little guy. <laughs> Holy cow, man. Crap. Little guy wore me out. <laughs> Look at that. That grub is done. see if he's even worth measuring. Nope, same size. Please be a flatty. Please, 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 please. Yes. Oh, what the heck is that? It's a sea robin. Check this out, guys. Oh my gosh. First time I ever caught one of these. Look at this. How's that for a fish right there? That's right, dance for the camera. <laughs> Thought it was a darn flatty. Let's get the pliers. I have no idea if these things got barbs or not, so I ain't gonna take a chance. There we go. We got him. down there 
at 35 feet. It's gonna be a little while to get them up. Gosh, cannot get them up. All right, there goes a leader. It's a small little blue. Oh my gosh. He's foul hooked. That's what took so long. This guy's gotta be hurting. Tiny foul hook little guy. God, he freaking. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that. That's one to tell the girls, huh? When he goes back down there. Small little fella. <laughs> Man, I thought I thought that one was it. Had the drag going. <laughs> I could only imagine what everybody else was thinking whenever they saw me reeling it in. 